Hey guys and welcome back to the channel and to another episode of Species Spotlight where today's spotlight is on the snake locks and enemy so I do hope you enjoy this video and if you do please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already so that you don't miss a video. So with all that out of the way let's look at some snake locks and enemies. So the snake locks and enemy is one of the many anemone species found along the UK's coast. They are either a greyish brown or bright green in colour with the green variety having purple tips. Their distribution stretches along the west coasts of England, Scotland and Ireland almost exclusively, as it seems to be completely absent from the east coasts of the UK. This species can be found up to 12 metres below the surface of the ocean, although they are pretty common in rock pools and intertidal zones. The brown coloured body of the anemone attaches itself to rocks, leaving the long, wavy, snake-like tentacles to sway with the current, hence the name. They are also able to retract their tentacles if they want to, but this is quite rare. The tentacles are home to a photosynthetic algae, which produces energy from sunlight. This is why you'll probably find these anemones in the sunniest spots in rock pools. These tentacles are also used to capture prey. These anemones have been known to feed on prawns, small fish and sea snails that are unlucky enough to get stung by these tentacles and eaten. And speaking of stinging, the sting from this anemone's tentacles is also pretty painful for humans, so make sure that you keep your hands away from them and also try not to step on them when you're out exploring the shore. I do hope you all enjoyed this episode of Species Spotlight and learned something new. Thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next video.